Oh, Sister Lizzie, sorry, I am sweating profusely. I just descended from the mountain. April 17th, exactly 2.30 a.m. I was in a trance and I saw five girls. Three from choir, two ushers. I said, God, what is this? God said to me, son, one of these girls will be your wife. I said, God, what should I do now? God said, son, go to the mountain and pray for 14 days. Immediately, Sister Lizzie, you won't believe it. I packed my things and I went to the mountain. And while I was praying and fasting, I said, God, reveal to me that particular one that will be my wife. On the 14th day, behold, I heard the voice of the Lord like a thunder saying, son, I want to deliver to you that woman that will be your wife. And behold, as I looked, I saw you coming down from heaven with a wedding gown. I said, Jesus, what is this? God said unto me, that is your wife. I said, God, I know Sister Lizzie from a distance. God said, go and meet her. Tell her what I have said. It is only the violet that take me by force. So I ran down here to tell you straight away that God said you will be my wife. No. Yes. I said no. Yes. If God says yes, who can say no? It's true nobody can say no. <laughs> Sister Lizzie, why are you crying? My, my story. I want to tell you my story. Oh, Sister Lizzie, God knows you. Who am I to know you more? I lost my parents when I was just 10. And so, is that it? I still love you, dear. Before 18 years, I slept with 64 men. <coughs> Committed 18 abortions. You can't so Katada. I don't have a womb. School ski school. And right now, I'm HIV positive. <laughs> I currently have kidney problem. Doctor said I have 18 months to live. <laughs> <laughs>